Hey guys, it's your boy Mark back with another video, and I'm here to give you my thoughts on the new 2021 Mortal Kombat film. Yes, this is. I just watched Mortal Kombat. I didn't go to the movies or nothing, I watched it on Soap Today, okay? Um, I was like, I wasn't like that excited for this movie, honestly. I was like, oh, cool, Mortal Kombat. You know, that's, that's how I felt about it, you know? And then, like, I, was, I went to check today to see if it was on. Um, and by the way, real quick, if you see on my second channel, Sandy Pictures, um, like, I've been doing so much universe mode lately. But SummerSlam, I have recorded all of SummerSlam. Um, that won't be up until May 3rd. At least I hope so, because... Um, I, I'm, I'm having real, a lot of trouble with that, man, uh, with, uh, with, uh, SummerSlam, because the freaking like, uh, video refuses to process, like, it, it processes up to 41% every time, and then it just freaking crashes. I don't know how to fix this, man, because I really worked so hard on SummerSlam. I just had to say that real quick, okay? So, yeah, one, hopefully one day I'll look back on this and be like, oh yeah, that crap was SummerSlam, and then that'll be after I, uh, I end up finally finishing and getting SummerSlam to process, because it's really pissing me off. But anyway, back to Mortal Kombat. Um, I thought this film started off fantastic. I was like, wow, what a way to start this film. It's, it's like, it, I guess this is going to be like a revenge type film. And, you know, fantastic opening for Mortal Kombat. Like I said, I wasn't, like, that excited for this film. Like, like I said, I was just like, oh, cool, Mortal Kombat, you know? And then, like... And then, like, when I watched it, I sat down, watched the whole thing. It was alright. It, it was alright, okay? It wasn't anything spectacular at all, honestly. It was just alright. Um, I do think, you know, they definitely tried, you know, to make this as fun of a movie as possible. Um... I don't know, I, I hate it when, like, it tries to, like, when, like, video game adaptations, like, try to be a video game, you know, you know what I mean? Like, it tries to be a video game instead of, like, actually trying to adapt it well into a film, you know, and there was so much, like, corny stuff in this film that, and you know, your boy loves corny stuff, you know, but... I don't know, like, when it comes, to, like, to this, and, like, it was so flashy, like, I am Liu Kang, I am Kong Lao, you know, it just comes off really corny to me, and, uh, it's like it's trying to be a video game, you know what I mean, it's not trying to, like, be a movie, and that that's why I love Sonic the Hedgehog, uh, so much, the Sonic the Hedgehog film that came out last year, that movie was awesome, um, that actually was a movie, like, it wasn't, like, that was, in my opinion, the best video game uh, movie ever. I'm so excited for Sonic 2, and, like, that's why I love that so much, because it actually tried to be a movie. It, wasn't, it didn't try to be, like, a video game. Like, it didn't try to have that video game feel, you know? It wasn't, like, you know what I mean? And I feel like you guys don't know what I mean. Hopefully I'm wrong, and you do know what I mean. But, um... Yeah, um, like I said, I do think they meant well with this film. I do think they tried, you know, to make this film as fun as possible. Uh, I was shocked at how little Scorpion was in this film. Because he was, like, the the big part of the opening scene. And then we don't we see, like, flashes of him throughout the film. And then, I, I don't want to say anything more, but, like, you know, because spoilers and all that. But, um, yeah, it was... It was just alright, man. Like, I will say this, though. Um, before I go into what I was going to say, I, I gotta say, I, I don't really care for Liu Kang. Honestly. Um, like, the guy who played Liu Kang. <laughs> uh, not that I'm a big Liu Kang fan, anyway. Um, you know, um, one thing that always bugged me about the 1995 Mortal Kombat was how Sub-Zero and Scorpion were decked for time in their movie. And they were kind of the same here, or at least Scorpion, you know. But, uh, you know, I'm sure a lot of people, you know, will love will love this film and have a blast with it, you know. The fatalities are awesome. Uh, they are brutal, just like the games, man. 
Um, this is actually R16 in New Zealand. Yeah, I'd say R16 is a is a is the right uh, uh, score to give this. Um, Shin Han uh, plays Shang Tsung. Shin Han, he was uh, Lao from The Dark Knight. Not who I would have like expected to play uh, Shang Tsung, but I'm. I was pleasantly surprised when I heard he was playing him. Like, wow, that's actually a pretty... And he he was great as Sh uh, Shang Tsung, you know? Um, he really was, man. Like, um, you know, uh, Sub-Zero and Scorpion, they are pretty awesome, you know, whenever they do appear on screen. Um, Sonya Blade was alright. Um... The main character, I already forgot his name. What was what was the name main character's name? He's a, he's not a game a, a video game character. I don't think so. He's a I think he's an original character that they made as the main character. Um I forgot his name, man. But he was all right. He was he was all right, you know. I thought he was Liu Kang. I won't lie <laughs> when he first appeared. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Mikhail Brooks, um, was awesome as, was, was fine as Jax, I want to say awesome, I, I was just, I was confusing me liking Mikhail Brooks, um, instead of Jax, that's why I was like, awesome, because I was thinking of, because I, I like Mikhail Brooks, he was alright as Jax, you know, um, he, I, I remember him from Ashtray Bitch from, uh, <laughs> uh, Tyler Perry's film from last year, uh, what was it called? Why am I so forgetful today? Um, a fall from grace, yeah. A fall from grace. Um, the main character, he has a family, and I won't. Um, and I won't lie. I thought he was a stepdad, you know, but he actually is the dad of the the girl, you know. I thought he was the stepdad because he just looked way too young. Kind of reminded me of me and someone else. But um, yeah, I'll say this though. The standout character of this film, by far to me, was Kano. He freaking stole the show, man. He was so crack up. Um, there was this, um, and like I said, I didn't like the, I loved the opening scene. I thought that was fantastic. Uh, and then I, I loved, like, and I, like, well, not love, but like, I didn't really care for, like, a good portion of, like, the movie, the rest of the movie, I'd, wasn't as big a fan of it. it. Got it picked up like in the second half for me, you know, quite a lot. Um, you know, but uh, you know what I mean. Um, but like, like I love love the opening scene, and there was this one scene, the egg roll scene. Kano was so awesome in that scene. In fact, Kano was awesome in everything that he was in in this movie. You know, I was, you know, he was he was cracker man. He was very charismatic. And he was just crack up. He, we don't ever see him with the uh, the middle uh, thing on his eye, though. Um, that middle, you know, the thing I'm talking about. Yeah. Um, but uh, yeah. Um, oh, uh, yeah. Like I said, Kano, best part of the film by far, and they definitely tease. They definitely want this to be a franchise and. You know, I wasn't that big a fan of this film, honestly. You, you guys know that, like, you know, like, like after 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 the opening scene, the, the film just got all like video gamey. Like, you know, it's it's like it was like trying to be like a video game instead of trying to make the perfect film adaptation. You know, like Sonic did. Like Sonic was fantastic, man. Um, but, you know, a lot of people like this film, cool, you know, if they do sequels, I, I will definitely, you know, watch them, you know, and give my, do movie thoughts videos for those whenever they come out, but, uh, yeah, overall, I, I think Mortal Kombat is alright, okay, I went in pretty excited, I, I really hate it when, like, the opening scene is so awesome, and then, the, and then it just dives off a cliff. I hate it when movies just peak in the opening scene, man. Like, I know that that would never be the intention, you know, to make a movie, you know, for that, you know, but... Yeah, just... Yeah, but... Kano, awesome. Uh, that air roll scene, awesome. 
Uh, overall, it, it was an alright film uh, to me. Uh, Goro was pretty cool too. You know, he wasn't in it much, but yeah. Um, anyway, I'm I'm gonna I'll probably I'll probably watch Nobody as well tonight. So you might see uh, movie thoughts for that too later. But uh, yeah. Um, overall, Mortal Kombat was alright. You know, just alright. You know. Uh, I'm not the biggest fan of the 1995 Mortal Kombat either, but, you know, I, I do feel a teeny bit nostalgic for that, but yeah, anyway, that's your boy's thoughts on Mortal Kombat 2021 movie thoughts, hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, if you guys have seen Mortal Kombat, tell me what you think, and if you enjoyed your boy's review, please let him know, because he'd very much appreciate it, alright, I'm your boy Mark, and uh, peace out, y'all.